Good old duct tape job, huh? Yeah. Say hi. Hi. Boomer. All right, build's complete. Puma's all done. Thanks for watching. <laughs> all right, ran over to my neighbor's house. Tomorrow his generic Articat key and his little panther. Yeah, the lights off. Spark. Fantastic. I see that on one side. On the other side. Hell yeah. Cool. They're 96 or 97. It's got to let you start. I don't know why it doesn't work, but what do you think, Chase? I think I'll go. Give her a little thirsty squirt. A little, uh, a little extra. Should be good. What's the temperature outside right now? Negative five? Yeah, give or take. Nice and cold. A little splashy splash in there. Pretty stone cold, but it'll go there. Cool. I bet that is still frozen too. The car's just full of crap. But it'll run, dude. She'll run. We've got that new fancy hypersonic cleaner over there. That'll Give us some good, see if we can get it to stop a little bit more. Maybe a little one plug trick. This thing's gonna tug your skidoo across the lawn. A little 340? Yeah. All 340 cc. He's got the weight on it. <laughs> yeah. So it's 400 bucks, man. Can't beat it. Little beater. For some reason, in interior Alaska right now, it's next to no snow in November, which is not normal. Nah, it's snow. Oh, cool. A little flurry, a little snowfall, a little plume of snowfall. Oh, gotcha. That's cool. Usually you can see fuel in the lines. I wonder if this has the, so that's an overflow, that's also an overflow, right? Yep, and then there's the feed line from the tank. Here we go. There's the spawn. Fuel filter. Sure, that thing's uh, seen better days. Yeah, I got a bunch over there. Shut that closed and give this a try. I think the fact that it's still kind of about 12 degrees inside this engine probably doesn't have a lot of fuel in the filter. Okay. Actually, it looks pretty clean. I'm just going to pull this rope a little bit more. Open. Oh, there's actually a fuel pump in here too. A little vacuum pump down here. Yeah. Cool. So it goes into a black fuel line. Yep. Oh no, it doesn't. Here we go. Yeah. So this is the 
the feed line. Okay, a little air bubble in there. Looks like there's some fuel. I'm just gonna keep moving this thing a little bit. Probably gonna take a car clean, I think. Be nice to have a spark, huh? All the people down here are watching that. Alright, so we'll be cleaning the carbs later. I'll give her one more shot. See if she starts sucking. But I have a feeling there's a whole bunch of crap in the bottom of this carb bowl here. Yeah. See the boot on this thing? It's ugly. I have to pull the airbox off, probably. Pull the fuel line. Overflow. Everything's frozen. All right, we should leave this around before we break stuff. Yeah, nice and crisp. <laughs> oh man, cool. That's pretty sure. Step one: remove airbox. <laughs> Complete. <laughs> There's no hardware in there. <laughs> Both these screws are missing. All we had to do is pull that off. Pull the Amazing. fuel valve off. Yeah. Dude, that should just pop right out. Yeah, it's one retaining little, screw on either side. Screw right there. Okay, well, see if we can do this without snapping it off. For science. Let's pop that bowl off, see what we got. Okay, complete. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, that's all water. That's the problem. There's moisture and crap. Oh, too sad. Not satisfying enough. Disgusting. Disgusting. Alright, so we'll. Huh. Cool. It's an interesting flow to the bottom. Oh, that junk down the bottom yeah, of that. See all that? Yummy. Yeah. Oh, there's your, there's your float. No shit. That's cool. Where are you, little pick? There you are. Twelve. One more rebo kits in there. What is that? Is it ice? No way. That's ice. Yeah, that's water for sure. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Let's pull this off too. That's crazy. Yeah, well that was the blockage, I think, man. A little bit of water jammed in there. Let's see if I can get this unscrewed up. supposed to be like wow look at all that crap in there that's so gross oh frozen God. solid yeah dude is it the overflow yeah so this is the overflow somebody blocked it did they block it why would you ever do that this must have been leaking that's what they did yes yeah, somebody jammed so something screw, in there. yeah yeah that's for science I mean, that surely fixed the problem, though, you know? Just just overflow the crap out of you. So the water doesn't, you know, flow out. It's cool. <laughs> Unspent water can't flow out. Just leave it in there. Wow. All right. Do these floats come out? I'm just going to leave it the way it is. 
Doesn't look like there's much to it. Oh, you know what? These little covers. <laughs> there's still ice in there too. It's Hang crazy. Out. I really don't want to break this. I'm gonna leave these in there. Okay, I'll let that thaw out. Needle. See that needle stuck? <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Very cool. So this should have a bar. Slides out. Yep. Entertaining them. A little bit of persuasion, maybe. Are you frozen or not? Do this without snapping these posts off. Oh, there we go. I had a pair of. Blocking. Oh, go. there she goes. Lucky on that one. I hope we took a video of which way this goes on. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Um, wow. On the operating right, table here. Yeah. Still rubberized? Trying to wire through it. Kind, kind of. of. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's not too bad. Still flexible. Let's see what we got. Ah. I'm just going to go ahead and pull this jet off. There we go. <laughs> you can see fuel coming up now. Oh, that's crazy. Look at that. Alright, there's our blockage, my friends. I wonder if. The old well drilled Nintendo brought the time. Look at this trick. I forgot the name of these. Oh, <laughs> look at that crap. Already leaking out. It's just a little ugly. Some of these actually have side inlets too. Oh, little passages. Yep, look at that. It's completely blocked. <laughs> That's why she wouldn't run. Yeah, it ran last year. Look at that. Bullshit, my friend. You got water frozen up? Better. Something. That's the passage. Okay. What do we got? Seven millimeter, maybe? Hmm, you smaller. Six? Wow. Six works. Snap this coming off. <laughs> we'll be screwed. To the eBay special. Cool. Yeah, that one's partially occluded. Yuck. These actually, oh, there's a jet in there too. Side passages on. Yeah. Not too terrible. This might not even fit there. <laughs> Some copper wire. Put this down before I lose it. Where are you? Well, I'll just strip another piece later, but this looks good.
<laughs> yep, I'm still ugly. <laughs> Dude, she's clogged, brother. Wow. Take that piece back out. I don't know if we can get this in there. Yeah, it's so tiny. Oh my god. I wish I had a compressor. Can I use a compressor? Yeah. Use a compressor. Oh, wait, I can't. Not the right way, at least. She's a little ugly, not too bad. Some crud in there. Seen better days. Yeah. Alright, well, let's grab the old car cleaner. Make a little sense of this. Poor Jordan. Actually, I might be able to wire that through. <laughs> <laughs> Come back. <laughs> he let me borrow his key and I broke it. Oh, man. A little cover. This is important. Everyone on YouTube needs to see this. You ever wondering how to fix your key fob? This is the way. Here, move it. <laughs> Difference. He'll never know. He'll never he know. Made like this. Yeah, just link him to the video. <laughs> cool. Why did you start? Still doesn't work. cleaning yeah i think we might toss this in there just for fun why not think? sure I'll probably clean it out though a little bit yeah as much as you can before you pop in there do it without breaking this gasket yeah in case you're wondering it's probably a 340 which way is down can't screw that up okay um Repair kit online for like 15 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go ahead and uh. Really don't want to do this. Okay. Take the hosing off. Oh, yes. Alright, for science. One, half, one, and a half. Two and a half, three and a quarter, three and a half. Okay. All the way down. Three and a half. So whenever you're trying to figure out what settings you need to keep stuff at, you can just tighten it all the way and know which way to put it back. Three and a half. All right, now the smaller one. You should just be tightened all the way, I think, but... Nah. One half. One full. One and a half. Okay. Three and a half big, one and a half small, too. Oh, gotta clean right now. There's a little spring in here, too. Probably about to lose. Okay. Should be a little rubber gasket in there too, I think. Maybe that's only on lawnmowers. <laughs> <laughs> that's ugly, dude. All right, well, we'll get out the carb cleaner. Maybe we'll pop these fuel lines off and just dunk this. What do you think? Yeah. Here we go. All right. Send it.
don't know if it's even worthy of that. <laughs> it looks good. <laughs> cool. These are going to be really great. You never got to figure out how to put these back on. <laughs> <laughs> Swap. Nice. She looks beautiful. Car cleaner! Should we give her a brand new can? Oh, yeah. Is she worthy? Oh, the trash can? The old boomer? Yeah, probably. I had gloves. It was cool. Yeah. Chase. <laughs> Definitely car cleaner, right? <laughs> Good. A little breather. And fuel. Oh, yeah. That'll do. Nice. Nice. There's some defroster in there at this yeah. point. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> this one's chlorinated. So if you need to use it, your pool, you can. <laughs> Disgusting. That's a block off plate. Block off plate. <laughs> oh, Splash We're zone. We're safe. Aren't you glad you wear your beautiful uh, Patagonia? Oh, this one's going to be a good one. Oh, yeah. Nice. My eyebrow. That poor trash can. You know, right? I found this on the side of the road when we first got here. The trash can doesn't have any carb issues, that's for sure. This <laughs> is the fastest trash can we've ever seen. I'm just getting we're taking way too much crab cleaner, but it'll be okay. Alright, let that sit for a minute. Oh. Yeah, that's sitting there for Yeah, we don't even need carb cleaner, we need heat in here. Yeah. <laughs> Melting all this crap. Oh, cool. Remember how this thing goes back together? Yeah. <laughs> Easy as one, two, three. It's a good noise. Yeah. Oh, you can answer the phone. No way. <laughs> just plastic. <laughs> yeah, just plastic. Best results. Cool. There we go. Be okay. Yeah. I think the uh, hypersonic thing is going to be a little overview. Yeah. We're just going to cut this. Cutting into an ice cube. Yeah. That's what these things are for. Oh, that's disgusting. That rough, too. Look at that. Oh, God. Oh, Lordy. That's good stuff. That, uh, that belongs in the carburetor right there. Yep. Ice. <laughs> Found it. Okay, cool. Is 
It's like a lag screw. I don't know what it is. Let's see. I don't it's know much, but that, that can't, that can't be factory. <laughs> so this is like a lag screw. On there since 1996. All right, put it on there last year to get it running. <laughs> yeah. Dad, seal her on up. Maybe it is factory. It's, a... it's not factory. Yuck. You know what we're going to do with this? Is put a new piece of fuel line on it. It's off a lawnmower, <laughs> but we'll throw it back on there because it looks like it worked at some point. So, oh, that's not gonna work for us. Swapping, yeah. Jeez. Oh, it might work up at the top actually. Perfect. Into the nether. <laughs> it's going. Ugh. Get a dog, they said. Okay. Not okay. Um, okay, remember where this goes? <laughs> bottom fuel. Um, the bottom of the bowl. Um, right there. You should expand the fuel line just a little bit. So many pressure out, so you should yeah. be good with that. That's beautiful. Alright. Should look clean? Yeah. Fresh out of the uh, the cleaner. For sure. The uh the gunk special. You know the deal. We don't play around. Fresh workspace. Something. All right. Pick your poison. Let's do this one and a half turns first. Bottom side, low side, what was it? Upside down. No, 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 no. Where are you? There you are. One and a half air fuel ratio, I think. You'll find out shortly. I think this is idle. What do we say? Three and a half? Mm -hmm. That's kind of dirty. Airborne. Amazed I didn't drop it. You know that gunk? Gunky, gunky. That's better. I just cross thread it, see what happens. <laughs> Get the impact out for it. Yeah, you're supposed to torque these. 120 <laughs> foot pounds. Four ogre duggers. Right. One, one, four, two, three, and eight. All right. Yeah. Pretty sure this is just idle. Um, all right, this one comes in through the bottom. I don't think I ever cleaned this, actually.
Mm. Tasty. This goes up. I'm in the middle. Nope. How dare I? Now, if you grab onto this, and look in there, if you turn this, so it lines up. Ah, so it's keyed. It's keyed, my friend. Maybe on there. No, this is the other one. And this little jet goes in the bottom. Right here. Just I mean, if you get this right, it'll start right up for you. It's true. It's not looking good. <laughs> okay. This goes on here. Where's my very small millimeter feeder? Ah, perfect. Quick release. Quick release carburetor tuning. Bye, Dan. Sausages. <laughs> God bless you, genetics. <laughs> now you torque this to 25 foot pounds. <laughs> All right. Take this little cover off. I'm like 25 inch pounds. Yeah. No, 125 foot pounds. <laughs> They're lug nuts, alright? Right. Can we do it? Zone. Ah, that's how much fuel it's gonna use. <laughs> Alright. Get in there. There's the old 10 now. I think it was actually a 9, I just sent it. It's 10. Mm. American. Don't lose it. The American kind of still had it. Yeah, right? I had to use the <laughs> quarter inch drive. Because the three eighths is always gone. Alright. Now, we guess how this goes back on. <laughs> the right way. A little trick I do with this. Tiny bit of WD-40 for some crazy reason. On the tip, a little tiny bit. Uh, is this the right spot now? In the right hole. Yeah. <laughs> Always put it in the right hole. That usually helps out a little bit. Okay. And you can tell this goes on the right way because of the way it is. No idea. <laughs> Pretty sure that's how it goes. All right, we're gonna pause this for a brief intermission. <laughs> and we're back. All right, now that we figured out that is in fact the correct way, you can test it out too, like that. But for those of you who actually have a 340 Puma, this little 90 degree on the right hand side and that little lip coming up, yep. Orientation matters. <laughs> Orientation matters. <laughs> you put that on a shirt. <laughs> Two soldiers lose their jobs for a YouTube video. All right. <laughs> 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 Tarzan over here. There we go. All right, 
she crosses over. Speaking of orientation. <laughs> what do you think? That looks fantastic. And yeah, the cool part, that doesn't really matter. This way. This way. This way. Not this way. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. You messed up. Oh jeez. <laughs> That's the wrong way. That is not the way. Oh, now we're talking. Maybe. It's definitely where that lived for a while. <laughs> And we'll be back. <laughs> and we're back. Beautiful. How oh, great. Yep, so a little X at the top. We like to put our X's at the bottom. <laughs> where they belong. Leave them in Texas. Oh, that's where they all live. <laughs> so, <laughs> 150 foot pounds there. I know you're not a big dirt bike guy, Chase, but if you ever get into YouTube dirt bikes, you'll come across the king, Cameron Namila, Namila, Namila. He's got a YouTube video of rebuilds performed by a person who knows what they're doing, not me. And uh, <laughs> awesome guy, but he always has, if you're paying attention to his videos, other little, uh, uh, what's the term? Nuggets of knowledge. Innuendo in there. Uh. <laughs> And it always makes me giggle. But I put the casket in there, right? Yeah! Okay. Ah! If not, we'll find out shortly. Well, good thing you uh, you blocked off the uh, overflow, so uh, it'll you leak out through the gasket. <laughs> That's what you want. It's leaking out into the airbox. Through yeah. the top. It doesn't leak if you can't see it. All right. Well, we keep a tiny carburetor, a star pattern. X, X, baby. No spare parts. Always a good, good sign. All right. Unless you get it from Ikea. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Choke. Where you at, though? Right, yeah. Just make sure it's oriented right. Be good. Get me the 12 mil. I need a 12 mil. Oh crap. Stay down. Hmm. I mean, you can just leave the wrench on it, you know. All right, two tests. Almost did that. Pretend you didn't see that. Slot goes to that side. All right, fire her up. Yeah, let her rip. <laughs> Take her chip. She is still frosty though. Dude, I'm telling you, it'll be a man. a snowball in there. All right. Airbox side, maybe. Good to go. All right. See that? It blocks it off. That's kind of cool. Let's the air in for win. Chase. Yeah. 
all, all 44 of them. <laughs> Survivor. I'm cold. Can I get in your truck? <laughs> <laughs> Was that show Survivor Man? Is that what it is? Naked and Afraid? Yeah. Oh, it's a different kind of show. Yeah. It's a good one. Cool. suck fuel for like five minutes. <laughs> fuel line. Cool. <laughs> That's good. Pizza people just, the right just way. Just suck on it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> quick, okay, quick start it. No, you, what you do is you pressurize your fuel, your fuel tank with your uh, air hose. Oh, <laughs> it's a uh, ideal. PSI. We're gonna start this thing without an air box for now. All right. Spark plugs plugged in. Oh, we plugged it. That's good. Oh, persuasion, maybe? Your starting fluid? Yeah. It's on the table. No, 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 no. The wrench. Special ingredient right there. The special sauce. <laughs> no, I'm sure we put the fuel line into the, uh, the spark plug. It'd be good. I'm going to pinch. How else are you going to get it in there? Cletus more, but that Cletus video where JH is driving across Cletus's lake with the boat running on the boat cleaner. Whoa, here we go. Come on. That's okay. We put a uh, we put bad fuel into the car into the carb, so yeah, she'll run eventually. Which pulls the water out of there. <laughs> Pretty much. Once the uh, when you burn the, burn the water out. Oh, I should have loosened the nut on the bottom of the. Ah, uh, to drain it out. Yeah. Water. I mean, it's uh, you didn't screw it in, did you? Uh, oh, that's true.
goes. Basically the same machine. You close one eye and then the other. <laughs> it's Chase ripping around. The boomer baby. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> 